Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, we will solve the problem best time to buy and sell stock 2. So I have already video solution on the best time to buy and sell stock problem 1 and 3 and the with cool down. So I am covering this problem as well because this problem will be needed in the best time to buy and sell stock problem 4. So say you have an array prices for which ith element in the price of the given stock on the day i. Design an algorithm to find the maximum profit. You may complete as many transactions as you like that is buy one and sell one share of the stock multiple times. You may not engage in multiple transactions at the same times. So that is you must sell the stock before you buy the new stock. So this is what the same problem just we are uh, allowed the multiple transaction as compared to in this stock problem one where we allow to be one transaction and get the maximum profit. So this is the prices array given. So here we have six day stock data where the price is on the first day seven one five three six four. So how we will solve this. So I have copied this here. So let us understand if it be by here then there is no day where the uh, stock price more than 7 then we can't sell it. So first let put this data on a some uh, chart like this. So on the day 1 the price is 7 let me mark it 7 is here somewhere and the day 2 the price is here let us say day 1, 2 is 1 is over here and day 3 is somewhere let us say 5 is here and 3 will be somewhere here then 6 will be above 5 and less than 6 this will be here and the 4 will be above 3 and between the 5. So this is the price data so just let me draw dot dotted line. So this is for day 1 and this is for day 2 and similarly this one is for day 3 and this one is for day 4 similarly this one is day 5 and this one is day 6. So this is the price data. And here let it write 7, 1, 5, 3, 6, 4. So now we will buy the stock. If you see the clearly, we can do multiple transactions, then we can buy over here one. So let me change the color of the pin. So <clears throat> we can buy the stock over here first and then sell here, buy one here and sell here. So we will get the profit of. Uh, 1 minus 5, 5 minus 1 which is 4 and similarly so this is our profit and we can buy again over here and shell over here. So this is if we do these two transaction we will get the tra profit of 4 plus 3 which is 7. So which is the maximum possible profit of allowing the transaction doing the multiple transactions. So the answer is 7. Now in the case let us take the prices data is like this. If we have prices data increasing then we will buy on the first day itself and sell on the last day the maximum price. So we will get the maximum. So this is the example 2 where we will buy on the day 1 which is of price 1 then sell on the day 5 which is on price 5. So we will get the profit 5 minus 1 which is 4. In case of reverse. so we do not have any day after the day current day which has max price greater than that current day price. So we cannot do perform any transaction. So the maximum profit just we are not doing any transaction here is a 0. So let us go over in the uh, example 1 itself. So if you see so finding this we can take the differences. So let us take another example uh, different example. Uh, let us say we have prices like 3 over here then next day we have 4 and the next day we have let us say 6 and after that the price is, is let us say 2 and the after that the price is uh, 4 again. So, so we will buy first share here and then sell it over here. So what we will do we will uh, one of the solution is find the basically this will be if we as like say first day one more transaction over here of price 8. So first we will find the value. So this will be the value of this curve and this will when this turn to here this will be the peak of our curve. So we will find the value over here then we will find the immediate next peak. So we will take the peak 
data minus value will be the profit of that transaction and that we will continuously do for full all the uh, of full data from starting 0th index to the last so if you see over here so for this let's take this transaction uh, let me change again pen here so let's take this transaction so for this transaction we are instead of like finding like the one of the solution you can find the valley and then peak and calc sum them up all the peak diff minus valley of corresponding peak and value diff values and uh, if you see this difference if we write this difference as a and the this difference as b so we can write that this overall difference which is let's say c as a a plus b so what we will do for easily solving this we just go through it whenever the we have the current ith index price is greater than the if we have the uh, this uh, price on the ith index if the price on the ith index is greater than so let's say price on the ith index is greater than the i minus 1 then we will keep at the difference in our profit so that is our profit so this we will do for all the array so this is the our solution so let's quickly implement the solution so first like say max profit profit initialize from the zero then iterate the array and int i is equal to zero and one more thing so as the first we have to buy then considering the i equals 0 is not in the point because we need to buy the first stock so first we will buy and we will check with the so i is less than prices dot length i plus plus then we will check if prices at i index is greater than prices at i minus 1 then we will keep adding this max profit uh, profit in the differences of the prices of i minus prices of i minus 1 into our max profit in the end we will just return the max profit so let us compile the code and see if it is working so it is working now we can submit the code and it will be accepted so the time complexity of this solution as you can see we are just iterating our array prices array which is o of n and the space complexity we are using just constant so it is constant so if you like this solution hit the like button and subscribe to my channel and also try to solve other problem like stock and wire forward and this and the four third problem as well thanks for watching